voilà, that's a food porn. Pizza dough for the house in three hours. Woo, super easy and simple. Hello guys from my studio, come on, what are you doing? You already eat it! Look at this, he's eating the Pazzerotto Barese. I went directly to Naples, I came all the way to Naples. It's the Vesuvio, the city of pizza, Naples. So now, this is the right place to make the Pazzerotto Barese. Mainly, we are here to see how to make the pizza fritta, original pizza fritta. Yes. Typical, typical street food the Neapolitan style. Easy recipe, we made the dough, mm. everything easy for you to remake at home. Mm. And uh, this is how you make the pizza fritta. Guys, watch until the end, invest your time. I went from Los Angeles to Naples for this, for you. I'm gonna finish this, enjoy how to make this uh, recipe. Guys, from passion with the maestro Roberto Susta. Guys, that's an amazing, that's history. Wow. Wow. Today is the day. This is Italian style. Same. Voila! Same Italian same. style. Yeah. Like my father, looks like my father with the. But uh, I got abs. Okay, Roberto, <laughs> so. New, new let's make this uh, because I don't have all day. Yes. Okay. Today, I have only five, six hours to be in Naples, so this recipe is going to be ready in five, six hours. Three Direct ore. pizza dough, three super. Ore. Three hours. Super easy to make at home. So, yes. guys, pay attention, follow this recipe, recipe in description. And follow my friend Pizza Yolo Napolitano on Instagram. Bye. Thank you so much. Let's start this. Okay. What we got? Go. All the water. Bye. Cold water? Yes, yes. Okay. 25 grammi di sale. 25 Tutti. grams of uh, salt. Tutti. E giriamo perché dobbiamo creare la soluzione salina. Negli impasti a mano è importante. Il sale aiuta a formare il glutine strong. Fantastic. Of course. Now all the flour. Oh, I see. No yeast yet. Yeah, yeah, no yeast so. yet. I'm here because I'm, uh, I'm gonna help him to to making the dough. Yes, yes. I'm excited to see this dough. And the so a little now, bit. So we use a zero zero flour. Yes, zero. Yes, yes. Zero zero flour. Okay. The mix a little bit. Fantastic. Get all together. Okay. Stop. Stop. Fresh yeast. Stop. 25 grams of fresh, oh, fresh yeast. yeast. Beautiful. <laughs> 25 grams of fresh yeast. Dry yeast? Quanto? Uh, no, dry yeast. Fresh no, yeast. Ah, you, okay. If they use uh, a dry yeast? 8 grams dry yeast. 8. 8. Okay. But the dough yeah. is going to be heavy with all this yeast. Sarà pesante questo impasto. No, no, no. That's why no, zero, zero flour is important. Yes. Oggi ti farò vedere come portare al raggiungimento della peptizzazione di un impasto diretto. The peptizzazione. The, 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 the yes. people that are Vabbè, creare... My grandmother doesn't know what that means. <laughs> peptizzazione yeah. che creare tutti gli ingredienti devono diventare colla. Ok, peptizzazione, pepti... peptizzazione. Pepti... I don't even know the word in English. It means glue. <laughs> glue yes, together. Yes. Quando è pronto, cioè quando abbiamo assorbito tutta l'acqua, yeah. questa massa va lavorata sul banco per 10-15 minuti. And so the whole process here probably is going to take about uh, 20 minutes total, yes. 20 minuti. Yes. Now the be one of the we best restaurant it. here in Bola, near Naples, is only 10 minutes from the airport, 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 from from the airport, from the airport, from the airport, from the airport, the taxi. Yeah. Just come here and eat the best, unique pizza in Naples. Naples. Soft and crunchy. Bravo. Soft time. and crunchy. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> you! Right, yeah. oh, stop. Okay. No, it's my turn. No, I'm gonna touch the dough. My touch work dough. is Done. ready. Done. Okay. Done. 50 minutes. Excuse me. Excuse me, master. Space. Yes, yes. Space. <laughs> That's it. So, we have to work the dough until it's nice and smooth. Yeah. Pizza dough for the house in three hours. Uh, super easy and simple. It's not sticky. Più forte. Bravissimo. Bravissimo. Perché dobbiamo simulare il lavoro di una planetaria. Okay, we'll break everything here. <laughs> we need to, they say that we need to, we need to be strong. Because strong. like uh, we are fighting with the door. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Fight yeah, with the door. Yeah, yeah. Fight with the door. Go. Good job. Good job. <laughs>
Oh, really? Ooh. What the, what was this smell? This smells yeah, yeah, so yeah. good. What is it? This is a Madari. Ah, that's the Madari. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wow, smells so that. good. Look at that. That's the Madari East. Mmm, If you want to see another video about this, comment below. Let me see. And smash that like. Let's see how many likes we get. If we get to 10,000 likes, maybe I want to show you how to make dough with the mother is from Roberto in, in, Sussa. In. Okay, at this point, you see the dough is nice and smooth. Now we let it rest for quanto tempo? 10 minutes. 10 minutes. 10 Fine. minutes. Fine. Ten, five, 10 minutes. And uh, <laughs> the time that the dough relax, and yes. then we're gonna make the balls. So this pizza is perfect to make it at home. So guys, make sure you yes. redo this at really? home and surprise your lovers. So right now, uh, with this pan, it's gonna be good because uh, we need to reach the oil at 200 Celsius. Yes. So now that the oil is warming up, let's go ahead and let's make the balls. Okay, okay Roberto, ready? about 10 minutes pass by. The dough is nice and strong now. So we need to make the balls about uh, 150 grams each. Yes. It depends how big is your pan. The more big is your pan, the bigger needs to be the dough ball. That's how you make the balls. So this is one way to make the ball. Oh, that's what we're gonna do. This one extra, I'm gonna show you how to make the Panzerotto Barese. Okay. okay, so we're gonna use this to make the Panzerotto. I'm gonna show him the Panzerotto Barese. You know what's Panzerotto Barese? Oggi ti faccio vedere già che stiamo. Since we are here, I'm gonna put this special right there. Voila, so now let's go ahead and let's wait about three hours. Okay. We need to cover. He's ready. The yeah. magic of uh, editing. So this is the dough after about uh, three hours, and uh, voila. So we got we gonna use uh, rice I, flour, I use rice, uh, rice, rice flour, flour, a lot of rice flour. Let's get ready with the ingredients. Yes, I, let's make it because the ingredients are particular, particular yeah. ingredients. Yeah. Ricotta Typical. cheese, uh, cicoli, cicoli, which is a mix of meat, uh, di latte, fresh pepper. mozzarella, paper. That's it. That's it, no sauce. Yes, a little bit. Okay, and sauce. Like it, huh? Okay, let's check the oil. Yeah, check, check. And the oil is... Uh, tender. Okay, just past 180 Celsius. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna go up. So, the dough, uh, the oil is ready. You need uh, something like that with a piece of paper and uh, those tools or two spoon and a fork, it's fine too. Wait a sec, <laughs> Robert, I wanna show you Go. The Panzerotto first. Okay. okay. Panzerotto Barese. Don't so worry. today we get the Naples and Bari fusion and voila! The Panzerotto Barese was born! That's how you mm. make it. Voila, voila! The dough ball is about 150 grams. We get the, the dough in the flour and we press the sides. Tutto all'esterno, oh. penso oh. che pure la pizza fritta è così. Yes. Press the side and then the center. Gento, voilà. Take off the flour and then upside down. The top needs to go on the bottom. A little bit of flour, voilà. So in this one, for the panzerotto, we put everything in the middle. Yeah. Voilà. Little bit of uh, so. mozzarella, little bit of cooked sauce, cooked sauce. Yes. Little bit of pepper. A little bit of parmesan we don't have it, it's okay. And now, that's it, that's the panzerotto. Okay. Now let's close it. We close the sides, make sure it's closed. If it's sticky, all uh, flour. Yeah. Pinch it, pinch it, pinch it, voila. And then we close the sides. Okay. Little bit of flour again, okay. voila. Now okay. we go in Good. the fryer. Let's go in the flour, in the fryer, gently. Leave it down, voila. Now, just uh, with the spoon, yes. put a little bit of, uh, of uh, oil on top like that. And then let's turn it, okay. voila. Go. If it opens up, my suggestion is to take it all right away out. Now we wait a few minutes more, and then we take it out. So here we go, the panzerotto, it's ready. Voila, take off all the oil and the panzerotto. It's ready. 
let it cool down and then now let's make the pizza fritta okay. that's the reason why we're here and then we taste everything together napolitan style right the key ingredients here is yes. the cicoli yes yes typical uh, if you don't have cicoli of yes. course guys you can use a prosciutto ham ah, similar mixed with the bacon similar voila so flour same way yeah a little bit little sticky on top so don't put the flour either way it's not gonna stick each other voila ricotta yes or we're gonna wait yeah, yeah, yeah. can i do it yeah ricotta so are you finished yeah, yeah, yeah okay so we put a little bit of ricotta yeah. on the middle yeah not all the way we need to keep the the sides because we need to close it yes then we put mozzarella or uh, cicoli, cicoli. Break the cicoli. <clears throat> Extra. The mozzarella. Yes, provolone. <clears throat> or provolone. There we go. Black pepper. Black pepper. Just cook it. Is it. Cook it tomato, yeah. Uh, That's the key. Now, like you can see, guys, he made it small. This way, he can make it a little bit bigger after. And then, and then it doesn't come out too thin. Okay. Now, now we close it. That's the, how you do it. Voilà. Facciamo uscire l'aria. Take off all the air from the inside. Aria. I didn't know that. Adesso usiamo la farina. Okay. So now that it's closed, we can use the flour. Beautiful. Lock it in. That's good. Fantastic. Spatula. Flour under. Again, gently ups and down on your hands, and then let's go up and bye. Beautiful, boom, 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 boom. Voila. And now we wait that it cooks gently. Beautiful. Mm. Se, vabbè, se sposti un po' il panzerotto così metti un po' più a destra. Ok. Now, turn. Okay. That's the most difficult part to yes, turn it. Yes, yes. So you need to be really be careful. <coughs> yes. E poi sempre con l'olio sopra, guarda. Fantastic, yeah? Mm -hmm. Typic uh, street food uh, Neapolitan style, eh? Amazing, look how it's pumping. Beautiful. Yeah. Okay, did you hear this? That means that it's uh, getting, it's getting open. Yeah. So right away, make sure it's not coming out too much water from outside, and uh, the pizza is ready. Okay, I'm ready. Gently go ahead and place it on the plate next to the panzerotto. Take a look of this pizza fritta. Wow. That's an amazing balloon. Voila, and the panzerotto. Roberto, the panzerotto, you don't eat it on the plate. Yeah. You eat it like that. Like this. Voila, and that's how you eat the panzerotto. But we are in two, we need to share. So, paper. Yeah. I'm super hungry. Right now, it's like one o'clock. Right now, let's go ahead and let's open up. Look, the sauce, the tomato. Hey, vedi come è bella. Beautiful. Voila. Yeah, that's for you. Thank you, thank nice you. Nice cold, because this, the best is to eat a little bit cold, not too hot. Oh, you're going already. Made only in three hours. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. I'm pizza here to fritta. taste your pizza fritta. Okay. Okay, let's do it. We got Caesar. Yes, yes. Voila. Voila. That's how you got the pizza fritta. Look inside. Ta -ta -ta. Voila, that's a food porn. Good. Like a pocket. Wow, take a look, guys. Mm. Beautiful. Mm. Mm. The taste is really good. Like really it. good with uh, yeah. all the mix of ingredients. It feels like in, I'm in Naples. Wow, guys. Molto buona. Thank you so much for watching. Go ahead, smash the like. 
check the recipe mm. on the bottom, check this channel, just make this at home, surprise your lover, yeah. friends, and lover. Thank you so much for watching. Watching?